Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got BB Big Bang water slide decals BBB012. So here they are. They came in that little packaging. So before we apply those I need to put some color down. I'm going to use the Bitsy Flawless. Just a white cream. You can use whatever white cream you have in your collection. I'm just going to do one coat. It doesn't have to be dead on perfect. You just want something underneath it. At least I do. <laughs> Been a while since I did some water slide decals. And these are the full nail designs. Excuse me. I got the hiccups. It's a very, very nice um, set of decals. Hi, Woody. How you doing? I'm going to top that flawless with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. I really thought these were super cute and it makes for a quick manicure. I've already cut the pieces off and soaked them on a dampened sponge and I am going to try the stamper application. So I flipped it upside down on the stamper and I'm rolling it over the nail. So there we go. We got one of them on. Very cute. These are just adorable. And that seems to be working, so I'm going to give it another go. And this one doesn't want to stick as well as the first one. It's not part of it wanted to, but it's not, it's just not coming off there real good. So I'm going to smooth it back out. I'm tapping my finger in the water on that sponge and get my nail wet a little bit and then it's stuck pretty good so there's a little bit of troubleshooting for me and I'm gonna do it with the next one oops if I can hang on to it so there we go these are so cute just look how cute the images well the scary one on the pinky is different but I think the rest of them are really cute. And I just decided to go back to the old way. This one didn't want to work so well with the stamper, so I just decided to just place it with my nails. I am taking a dry makeup sponge and I'm just mushing them down, making sure they're nice and flat. And I also might, you know, get some water up if there's any excess water still kind of hanging around. Now for a little bit of cleanup, make sure that's all down around the nail. I do have a little cup of acetone there, and I'm using my cleanup brush to go around, tapping across the end here. And I'm going to show you the cleanup on all of four of these nails. Um, to me, that's the key, the the kicker for making water decals, that especially the full full nail image ones. To making them look good is doing your cleanup. I kind of do a little bit of patting and then some wiping. It's just a little, my little way of doing it. Kind of tap, tap, and then wipe. It just seems to work good for me. I love that little image. And then on the edge, I'm going to go around to make sure I'm happy with how that looks because I don't want a bunch of that curled up underneath the nail. So there we go, we got one done. Let's do another. I love that image. Jack o' lanterns and ghosts. How adorable. Pretty sad that the Halloween season is fixing to be over and uh, there will be no more Halloween manis for me. I have tried to get in some this year, as always. Doing some more of that tapping there. Kind of going around that edge, making sure I've got it smooth and that there's not clumps of stuff hiding out under my nail. But these were really easy to use. Um, I am a fan of water decals. I, I really do like that they make a really nice manicure and, and it's easy or can be easy. I've had some decals that were a little tricky to work with, but these were really fine. I didn't have any issues at all. 
they weren't too thick. They, I didn't have trouble cleaning them up. They, they did really well. And I just, I like, I like it when it can be easy. Nobody likes being on the struggle bus, right? So this one worked out really well for me. I think they're just as cute as can be. So I'm going to top these with posh top coat. They don't have any holographic, metallic, or chromey things in it. So I didn't worry about using a water-based top coat. I was able to use just a regular top coat. Well, a regular fast-drying top coat. So there they are. Aren't they cute? <laughs> so here's my swatch photo. I would love to hear what you think about this, Manny. Leave me a comment down below. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.